have a great brunch, I promise. Did you take your pills? In crisis situations, individuals will experience several emotional phases, the first of which is an overwhelming helplessness, known as the impact phase. What follows is the inventory stage, where survivors take stock of available resources and locate others in an attempt to minimize feelings of isolation. Are you hurt? Whose blood is that? I, I don't know. Where are your parents? They're gone. Why don't you put this on? This is my dad's house. Are you hungry? Yeah. Dad? Lata! Oh, God. Thank you, God. Thank you. I didn't know what to do. There's nobody to call. Dad, what's happening? What is this? People are sick. The information is all so fucking vague. Who's the kid? He's going to be coming with us, Dad. God damn it. Look at me. How far do you think I'll get? Dad. I've got plenty of food. Take care of myself. <sighs> Dad, you're out of your mind. Marta, I am not going to be the reason you can't get out of here. Daddy. Get in the truck and go. 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 Despite the variables, we have numerous tactical advantages. By removing and externalising ideas of hope, we can make survivors believe their best chances lie with us. Ooh, wait, who is that? Do you hear that? Yeah, well it's music. This is not a drill. Uh, All survivors are asked to Why would somebody be playing music? Medical center why haven't we heard from anyone? Someone? The Surgeon General? The President? Something's not right. This isn't is right. Listen, you're going to get the vaccine. I promise. Let's get the fuck out of Manchester. I'm sorry, I cussed. Don't worry about it.
The recovery phase presents the largest challenge for us. Under duress, individuals will begin to question their physical reality. This necessitates the appearance of authority and all personnel involved. Can we pass through? Turn around and drive directly back to the Manchester Medical Centre. If we've had the vaccine, can we pass through? Get out the car. Get out the car right now. I fucking heard you. On the ground. Do it now. Don't harm her. March 12, 2010, Project 27 Post Action Report. In spite of official instructions, government enforced roadblocks and even the promise of an antidote. Project 27 is a confirmed failure. A breach was achieved. As stated in my earlier report, these simulations will continue to fail if we do not achieve 100% containment. An actual outbreak would be catastrophic. Once again, these outliers and their will to survive are simply more powerful than any reality we place in front of them. And I'm afraid humanity's ability to hope is in fact will be our demise. End of report.